I'm Harrison Keeley. Here's what you need to know today. First, a man was shot last night after being asked if he needed a ride. Police say 31-year-old Galen Williams was walking on Central Avenue near Alton Park when it happened. He was shot once in the thigh and taken to a hospital. He's expected to survive. Anyone with information is asked to call the police. A state of emergency is being declared across northwest Georgia. It comes ahead of a wave of snow and ice expected over the next two days. Governor Nathan Deal's order covers 15 counties. It will free up employees and equipment to respond to the weather. Up to two inches of snow are expected across the Times Free Press coverage area. A winter weather advisory has been issued, and the National Weather Service says we may see more snow on Friday and Saturday. The lineup for this year's Bonnaroo Festival has been announced. Acts include Pearl Jam, LCD Sound System, Macklemore, and Death Cab for Cutie. The event is June 9th through 12th in Manchester. Tickets start at $325 and go on sale Friday at Bonnaroo.com. You can see the full lineup at timesfreepress.com. First responders will be allowed to accept $1,000 checks for psychological trauma they suffered during the July 16th attacks after all. City code currently forbids employees from accepting gifts for services performed during their jobs, but the city council voted 9-1 to one to make an exception. Councilman Larry Grone voted against the measure. A judge has ordered that the Signal Mountain man accused of plotting to kill Muslims be tested for insanity. Magistrate Susan Lee commanded that Robert Doggart undergo a 45-day mental health evaluation. Doggart ran for Congress in 2014 and allegedly spent months planning an attack on a New York community called Islamburg. A new study says less than half of the major roads in the Chattanooga area are in good condition. The study also says the average local driver loses nearly $1,500 a year due to traffic congestion and other conditions. That's close to $6 billion statewide. Alabama Shakes is returning to Chattanooga. The band will perform at Track 29 on April 25th. Tickets start at $41. The UTC football team has named Kerry Bailey as its new defensive line coach. Also, former mock Kadeem Wise will become director of football operations. Volkswagen has appointed a new chief for its North American region. Heinrich Wobkin will begin April 1st. Walker County claims it doesn't owe Erlanger for bailing out Hutchinson Medical Center. After all, county leaders hope to avoid paying about $9 million by arguing that a promise made five years ago wasn't actually binding. In 2011, Hutchinson's board gave Erlanger permission to pursue the money from Walker County if it wasn't paid back. Now the county is asking a judge to dismiss the case based on technicalities. Turning to weather, today will be snowy with a high near 35 degrees. Tonight's low will be around 33. That's it for today's news. Thanks for being with us. You can find more on these stories and breaking news at timesrepress.com.